To capture a report, start on the gallery screen and tap the report icon in the bottom. Make sure you are on the right project and then select the report template. Once you're in the report, it will open to the general information. As you see, most of these fields will be pre-populated for you. To easily navigate through questions in a chapter, use the previous and next buttons in the bottom of the screen. To answer a question, select next, select on the answer field, and then choose from the options provided. To access different chapters of the report, tap on the menu icon in the bottom left corner. For questions that add photos to a report, you will be able to snap new photos or select from the gallery. Tapping the gallery icon, you can then tap multiple photos and tap add photos at the top of the screen to add them to the report. Once you're finished filling out the report, one option is to tap the icon in the upper right corner. Here you can delete the draft or export to PDF. Preview the PDF and then you can go ahead and email it. Another option is to tap the save icon at the bottom of the screen. You can complete the report and sync it to your storage provider. You can sync a draft that will be editable on the web portal, or you can save a draft that will be editable from your mobile device. All reports can be accessed from the mobile device in the report gallery. Synced drafts and re completed reports can be accessed on the web portal, and completed reports will be accessed in your storage as well.